It's less than 24 hours until Pippa's big day. We're just outside of the family's hometown pub in Buckleberry, five miles away from St. Mark's Church. But the party, that's going to be just down the road. We're hearing a Scottish theme. Last minute preparations, no doubt, underway for the high society wedding of the year. The world first fell for her when she strolled down the aisle with that show stealing silhouette. Pippa Middleton was maid of honor then. Tomorrow, it's her turn to be the bride. The question on everyone's mind, which dress will get the yes? The details, strictly under wraps. But the leading contender, rumored to be British designer Giles Deacon. If you can just give me a sense of what Giles is, style yeah. is like. His Known for his extravagant couture creations. But one thing that he really does know how to do is drama and glamour. So I imagine even though Pippa is likely to be relatively traditional and elegant, there's a nice potential in there for a bit of a twist. James Matthews is the hedge fund hunk who won Pippa's heart. Friends for over a decade, briefly dating in 2012, the fitness buffs share a passion for sports and the countryside. And that's where the pair will tie the knot. Just six miles away from the Middleton family home, the reception back at the estate and guaranteed to dazzle after dark. No expense spared. This glass party palace will allow guests to dance the night away, rain or shine. Even the porta potties are posh, throne rooms fit for a queen. It may not be a royal wedding, but there's no doubt this will be a royal affair. The Duke and Duchess of Cambridge will attend. No maid of honor role for big sister Kate. Instead, a pint sized Princess Charlotte and Prince George will join Auntie down the aisle. A role the Middleton sisters know well. Seen here at their uncle's wedding, Kate, then nine, and Pippa, just seven. Clearly not a fan of her floral crown. And despite that reported no ring, no bring rule, American actress Meghan Markle will be there on Prince Harry's arm. Everybody there is keen to meet Meghan because she may well be a future princess. So do you expect that uh, we'll see Meghan and Harry over on that balcony down yonder? <laughs> Fingers crossed. I think all of the signs for their relationship are looking very positive. It's definitely serious. Now, when you're fifth in line to the throne, popping the question is no simple task. Prince Harry is going to have to ask the Queen's permission. But I'm obviously getting carried away here, guys. It is Pippa's big day. Pippa's turn to shine. A lot of excitement here, especially over that mystery dress, guys. Oh, Lucy, it's going to be big news for the, over the weekend. You're going to have a lot more on that big event tomorrow morning on today. Thanks, honey. Hello today, fans. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Subscribe by clicking that button down there. And click on any of the videos over here to watch the latest interviews, show highlights, and digital exclusives.